My obsession caused this great foulness, and it is shameful that I must rely upon you to set it right. Wait, Summer has left on a quest of personal hardship and pain. Oh no, Summer, goddammit. Uh, what are recruits? Nothing notable. Yeah, this barely budge. Mm, not gonna go back to it because the thing is roaming around. Sunshine in the thicket. Activate three infected corpses. Mm. The occultist with extra dam damage on the occultist slot. Uh, uh, I think, uh, what's this one? Eldritch, bleed resist, minus 20%. Oh my god. Plus 4 speed and debuff. Wait, what does the antiquarian even debuff? Stab, debuff resist, debuff accuracy. So, minus bleed resist and accuracy. I mean, the 4 speed's nice. I mean, if anything, I might just do this for the 4 speed. Although the Sunshine is- actually, what, what does that event do? Huh. What does Sunshine do? Oh, wait, no, no, it's the generic stuff for extra resolve and damage. Kind of like the Gentle Tide in the Cove and stuff. Nah, th this ain't worth my time. Uh, I just want to keep doing the short and quick stuff. Like, I really need to keep making cheap but efficient missions around here as I rotate because I should be able to deal with the Crimson Core well enough at this point. Also, hmm. Let me see, how many crests can I trade in? 16. Oh, actually that's enough. Oh yes, we got our vintners now. Nice. So now we got our now we got a good supply of blood. So now we don't have to keep or we we don't have to make uh expeditions to the winemakers reserves. All right. So that's one extra dependency taken off our list. So, next up, probably... Hmm, I mean, I guess I don't have much on the priority list if I kind of sacrificed everything else, though. But, uh, yeah, I think next up would be the Altar of Light. I gotta get it work eventually on the, uh, memories, though. Should I do the Endless Harvest more often? Because at least even if I get the, the shards, I could get pretty good stuff. Hello? Hmm. Hmm. Actually, no, I think the gem inventory is the only one worth. <laughs> This shirts are nice, but I could just avoid this if I just didn't enable Crimson Coin in the first place. Fair enough. But I just wanted to do this because I've played enough of the base game as is during early access and on and off when I gave Darkest Dungeon a couple tries, but kind of stopped around week 20 something for various reasons. 
So, like, I've already seen enough of, like, the vanilla game that I'm just like, okay, you know what? Just, just throw everything at me. And I got what I asked for. In the worst way possible. <laughs> F the Crimson Court so much. Ugh. Oh, show me what you got. <laughs> I was like, oh god, wait, no, no, no more. Alright, but we need, we need to do some treatment, though. Let's get rid of the Black Plague, or Black Plague, Red Plague. Oh god, if we had the Black Plague, everyone would be freaking dead already. <laughs> uh, Hagamania. Why precise striking? Why couldn't you replace unerring? Who needs damage on the Vestal? Uh, let's let's put away torn rotator because that will reduce our finale damage. And Kigali, I'm gonna have to put you away for another week, Kigali. I apologize, but you are a skilled gambler, but you're not allowed to gamble. I can't have that. I, I need you to make me some money. It's totally a waste of money, but <laughs> screw it, I want you to gamble. Okay, what's Senkai gonna do? Uh, you will never drink, so no drink or meditating. I think I could make you God-fearing. Because it would help if, uh... If I can use Prey, maybe. Or... Never drink... Meditate. Wait, is there any quirks that you have that I would not want replaced? No, nah, all these are replaceable. Alright. So you're gonna be out for a little while. Oh, come on. <laughs> now they offer this. Although I don't although I'm not sure. Do I really want to do dodge tanking at death's door with the flagellant all the time? I don't know. Also, I was this close to buying the collar by accident. I right clicked. Whoops, that would have been really bad. Alright, let me double check In again. Time, you will know the tragic extent so then, of my failings. This is the cost of so 50%, 12 k for very rare stuff. Hmm. Okay, but what's our plan? Do we keep grinding it out until we get more people leveled up decently? Like, I think it's pretty much about time to ditch these abominations. They honestly don't have much going for them. But I guess I'll keep waiting, I suppose. Oh. So probably... Hmm. Force speed. Actually, what do I equip on an antiquarian? So let's say that force speed thing, or actually, no, what do I equip in general? How is your resistances? 70 average going up to 80, I'm assuming, at max level. So, 80 all around. Well, I could just get you this, but let's see. So I'd have the overture box, and then probably protection and HP, since you're not gonna do damage anyways.
Yeah, that's pretty much about it. Hmm. Cause, uh, maybe I could do a... Uh, money run. Oh, no, no. But I'm doing... Well, no, this is the wield. The beasts have blight, better blight resistance. The warrens, though... Uh, that's a little bit different. Although, with the warrens, or wield, I mean, I can find more uh, deeds. Oh, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe I should just bring the antiquarian, anyways. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we'll just bring the Antiquarian. And who else is level 5 that I could bring in? Uh, I can bring in Disc at this point. Mm, I think I can bring in the other Flagellant. Or actually, maybe I should, maybe I should just go with double Flagellants. I wonder if I can bring in Seraph and get him leveled up. Hmm. What would the weakness be with two flagellants? Well, although I guess there's the obvious thing. No direct damage, no burst. So no outright killing. Hey, maybe I'll just bring a Hellion. Yeah, yeah, this, this, this is a good team, I think. Alright, so what do we got? We got Ancestor's Pen, Crit, Damage, all I can ask for. And your resistances are pretty good all around. And I am not sure if I can even get the benefit out of this. I would love the set bonus, but... Until then, I think I'll hold off on this one in particular. Um, hmm. So, do I take 30% extra damage? Or, like, get 30% extra damage with minus one speed, making this absolute garbage? Or do I take the locket to speed up the Hellion so that she can have her turn right away or a little quicker. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Sleepiness is getting to me already. For some reason, I woke up at like. What was it? Was it 6 in the morning for some reason? I don't know. Yeah, it's a little bit of trouble. Getting back to sleep earlier, since it was a little too early in the morning for my taste. But, uh, let's see, so you're outfitted, you're outfitted with crit. Keeping this. Uh, actually, wait. Hmm. Extra speed if have the crimson and debuff, or I can just take Mildred's locket. No uh, penalties from losing stun resist. I would not want to lose it actually, because I know that there will be the beast enemies that can blight. So they'll be pretty nasty if they do get it off. So. Get some extra resistance in there. Extra speed for better turn orders. That's all good. And then Antiquarian is gonna tank it up. Alright. 
Alright, I think that's... Oh, actually, the part of the problem with this is... Well, partially the fact that I don't have the Jester for accuracy buffing. No one buffs. Or, no one buffs for combat. Although, I guess, uh... Uh, actually, I guess there is Adrenaline Rush. Like, maybe do this on turn one, get some accuracy, and start wailing away. Try to ensure we get hits in. I don't know, that's all I can think about. <laughs> How you doing, Noodle? Wait, you only go up to 5 to 9? Oh my god, that's garbage. Hmm. Actually, what did I get? Oh, right, I got two of these. Yeah, you can only have one, so... And I'm, I don't think I feel like having a double Grave Robber team if I get a second one. So I think I'll just toss one away to fund the upgrade. Oh wait, no, this one's cheaper, and we get to upgrade it and everything. Uh, do we need extra health? I think the flagellant would like this. You have the lowest health out of anyone, and I think I'll leave it at that. I think I don't want to go any lower than 27k if I just toss out a number. Actually, wait, how much would 27k get me if the bank interest would, were to come into effect? 27k... That would get me roughly... 1350 gold... If I... Don't spend any more than that. So I think we can finish... Let me see... Oh, right, we still need these ones. I think this one's fine on its own at level 4. So, these ones for sure. And. I think I'll leave all these as is. As for the Hellion, we could try getting and making use of uh, Barbaric Yop. I mean, it is pretty good, a double stun, but I don't want to invest in all that right now. Also, I would still like if it bleeds. One, two, three. No, that's going to bite into my budget. Uh, I think for sure I'd want to take this one. Uh, this thing's gonna miss often if I don't do anything about it. Yeah, you know what? I'll just, I'll just take these two and kind of leave the rest, maybe. So, 1k over what I wanted to save, but, uh, that's fine. So we'll go do this mission since it's a short one. So this one's all room battles. Oh wait. Oh, you know what I just noticed? I did not realize that the symbol for doing room battles was basically a bunch of armed soldiers if you can make it out for for the longest time it looked like a bunch of houses <laughs> which doesn't make sense especially when you read the the type of mission it is kill it beat all the fights but i actually i I was wondering, like, why does it look like a bunch of houses? <laughs> oh my god. 
How long have I played Darkest Dungeon on and off since early access and never realized it until now? <laughs> I was like, huh. What, what is this? So if we're going to the wheel, that's the forest. We can find animal carcasses. Take three. Anti venom for the trees for loot. Actually, I think I'll just take extra. Uh, we'll take two keys. There could be one. Actually, what was the what are the types of stuff I can find in the wheel again? The mind's failing me. Uh, right, the effigy and fountain. Uh, I'll just take one, just in case. Actually, maybe, maybe two. And then torches, we can put this all the way up. And I think two things of blood bowl. Maybe three things of blood will keep us afloat for a while. So, lining everything up together. Consumables go here. Hmm, let me think. Because blighting will be a problem in fights, bleeding, possibly. Or we can use bandages on the spider trees. I did not realize you can use anti venom on the old tree, but <laughs> now I know. Uh, medicinal herbs for food, and potentially nasty debuffs. Because basically, if I want to ensure that I can get through the rest of the dungeon without food issues. If I can find one beast carcass, that's all I need. The rest, of <clears throat> the rest of this can go into whatever other curios or fights. Looking over the stuff here, uh, we do have minus stress, but we don't. Oh, but we don't have a way to. Uh... Although I guess we can will will willingly put the flagellant into. Rapturous mode. Hmm. Eh, yeah, sure. Take that. I don't think I'll take any nervous stabs. Since it does F all for damage, anyways. Yeah. I think I'll just go with this. Has soaked the soil, oh. sapping all good life from these groves. Oh, Let us burn out this evil. Christmas came early today because look at this straight path. Oh, this lay this layout. Oh, that's beautiful. No detours. Oh, oh. Oh. Nature herself. But we're, we're doing this early, aren't we? Malformed with missing. No, intent. no! What are you doing? I didn't unlock it. You piece of shit. Okay, you're going to the sanitarium. That could have been good loot. Oh my. They're gonna make loot. What are you? Oh, are you? Oh my god, it's basically like a stronger version of the occultist that was an enemy. Oh goodness. Oh wait, oh, rend the mark. 
Oh no, that's gonna do so much damage. Bringing the antiquarian was a mistake. Too. I'm gonna kill. 13 damage. That's oh my god. That's what I get for not upgrading my health. Uh, Ren the marked is such a nasty skill. Death by inches. All right, so we can't iron swan anymore, but we're just gonna have to bleed it to death. Oh my god, everyone's marked. That means everyone will take increased damage, it's just a matter of who's gonna take that increased damage. 11 damage is nothing when they do 13 or so per strike. And I need to focus on... No, I can't focus on you. This is doing nothing. I just hope that they aim for the flagellant more. You're fine. Oh, is that a bigger debuff? Oh no, just pure blight. Minus 20 dodge and accuracy. Oh god. Sedated. Hmm. Yeah, Blight, uh, Blight's useless. I didn't think it'd be this bad. But, apparently I'm wrong. Mm. You know what, I'm, I might actually just have to do a get down. Just in case. Well, I just wasted my flagellant's turn. I was not banking on that crit. Death waits for the slightest lapse in concentration. Let's heal you up so you're not at death's door. Oh my god. 59% and I just upgraded this to level 5. Oh my god. Okay. The formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. No! I didn't want to crit heal! Oh wait, does that put you in? No, god damn it. How much is 48, 40% HP with this? Are you kidding me? I had to be at 18 health? Oh my god, I needed to be 18 health to trigger the, the burst heal. Oh my god. Ugh. <laughs> You actually dodged. Oh my god. The light, the promise of safety. Okay, no, no, we're good, we're good. Much better. And I. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Uh, this ancestral pen, though, pretty neat. Pretty neat. Foolish horrors brought low and driven into the mud. 
Hmm. Oh, wait, can I not? Oh. Oh, self inflicted debuffs cannot be purged off with medicinal herbs. Okay, although I guess it makes sense balance wise because that would basically make these like meaningless, but. Hmm. Alright, wasting away already. Well, it's a good thing you turned from wasting to passive, otherwise you'd activate this in a heartbeat. Oh no. Dogs. Oh, okay. Make them bleed. Okay, wait, if that's 5, go down to 11. Actually, I think I can leave these two alone. And then... Probably stun the front. Do I blight? No, I shouldn't bother. Uh, rapid rush. I think. Wait, who has the worst bleed resist? 90, 95, 85. Uh. Oh god, they can miss. So Got him. Okay, but that means the, uh... I can't backline them anymore. I kinda actually wish they left corpses to help me with positioning. Also, I really wish I could use a breakthrough here. Also, I just noticed that the flagellants seriously get blood. Such a ah. terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. Ow. I can't reach this one. Or can I? Nice. Slowly. Gently. This so is three, how life is two taken. off from 40%. Blech. Uh you're almost dead. And Five, six. Oh no, they're both at six. Yeah, okay, I think I'll hit one. Then just heal up. Don't wanna de-stress anyone and get me get the flagellant closer to Rapturous. by two speed, these two would be competing for who goes first, and this is an RNG chance, given that we have 21% chance to miss. So 20, banking on 21% chance to miss, or stress healing real quick. Uh, I'd say we take the riskier option and try it out. On its own. Nice. We went first. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Always remember to select the antiquarian when you unlock loot and is trapped. And again, no scouting, unfortunately. Oh great, three checks already. Packs Ooh. laden with loot are often low on supplies. Okay, provide jade. Okay, okay. I'm gonna sort this out. So this stuff on top. Money over here. So this is all the stuff we can throw away. All right. I, I gotta make sure I use uh, these things a bit more liberally uh, during fights, so I can free up the inventory as we delve deeper. Mm, clear marked. Oh wait. Oh right, right. It clears a marked heart. Actually, let me take that. 
Like the uh, the fungi enemies or whatever can get real nasty against enemies that can mark. Oh my god, it's been nothing but room battle after room battle and oh god. Damn it. Minus accuracy with flash powder. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 what, what is your debuff resist? 110. I mean, you are a champion or elite, or, or a champion elite enemy, but, oh my, that only leaves me with 20% chance. Oh, that is not worth it. Pocket sand. Uh, he, you resisted on a 130. Hey, Wiz, thank you for the three months. How are you doing? Okay, wait, wait. This is 50, 130, uh, it's 80. 75% chance to hit, and I missed it. Blech. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Please. Thank you. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Oh, God, no. Rend the mark BS again. Here we go. W wait, from de <gasps> What is? What? Oh wait, you disable healing? What the fuck? You disable healing? Oh my god. What? Oh my god, I, have to, I actually have to kill you last because I can't bear missing all the time. Destroyed. Oh, okay, okay, first turn. We still missed out on a round of healing though because the Vesta went first. Kill the cars. Oh, not again. Mm. <sighs> do I do I use this turn to buff up or just keep doing damage? Nah, I keep doing damage. Six. Oh, he's dead. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. The debuff. Do I want to rely on accuracy debuffs? I mean... Sure. Or, no, I mean... <laughs> I mean, I was gonna use the other thing. Uh, I wish I had protection right now. I need to take out Festering Vapors, it's not doing anything for me. Hello? <laughs> okay. We can do that too. But I wonder... Maybe... No, no, it might take too long to transfer the aggro and damage, so I can use Redeem. Let's see. 
12 damage, 7 left. Alright. Be wary. Ooh. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Ooh. Minus stress and more accuracy of torches above a certain amount. But I do like my damage though. That was pretty much the only reason I still got to do big damage against the mushrooms. Musketeer, medic boots. Hmm. <laughs> Do you want to replace something though? Uh, hmm. Maybe the portraits. Yeah, I think I'll replace the portraits. If I want, if I want portraits, I'll go to the Warrens. Alright, and pristine fountain. Let's get some stress heals. Hmm. Oh yeah. Nervous stab, get down. This one, this one. Actually, no, the enemies have high debuff resist. And protect me, I need to level this up if I want to warrant using this again. It's not going to be worth giving someone aggro without adequate protection. Or passing aggro on to someone, I mean. Oh? Ah, oh, we don't know what the last one is. Oh. Okay, I did not realize we were fighting here. Oh, dogs. Sit down. Hmm. I mean, I could just kill them right away. Rather than chancing a miss. Okay, one off lethal. Of course, dogs have high accuracy because just because. A momentary abatement. Decimated. And stabby stabby. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They oh. can be beaten. Am I gonna dig up this grave for money? Oh yeah. Uh I do need deeds. In radiance, may we find victory. If we do get a effigy thing, uh, I want to keep this. Hmm. Maybe I replace the, the hairpin. Because there still could be strong boxes that I can unlock with these. Wait, what's that, Skylock? Did I know that the Russians use dogs as replacement snipers? Wait, what? <laughs> Uh, let's see, I still need this. Mm. Yeah, uh, I guess I wasn't really keeping this. Oh well. I know that was a lot I gave away, but... There'll always be more loot. Oh, but get ready for a fight. Ooh. Ooh. Oh right, we can't we can't blight or bleed because there's no fourth position to hit the crony.
Uh, RNG has to screw me, doesn't it? Or not? For now. Fine, fine, we'll get the more guaranteed kill first. Obliterated. Get over here. Mm. Alright. Exposed to a killing blow. Mm, vulnerability not bad, but minus dodge and accuracy on both. That is sensor? What is that move? Oh, blight. Four blight. Hmm. Yeah, let's go use it. Still hit despite the penalty. Screw you. Um, uh, stabby stab? Oh, <laughs> 47 percent. Hell no. Hey, Nefarious. How are you doing? So I can cure Blight or Bleed on myself or go for damage. I'm gonna go for damage. Ooh. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Hmm. Money problems. Okay, fine. If I find, if I find an effigy in the next corner, I will flip my table. But I have no choice. Uh, I guess I might as well use this too. Uh, er. Hmm. No anti-venom though. Uh, gotta get ready for a room battle though. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. How goes Darkest Dungeon? Uh so far it's pretty alright. I'm getting flashbacks of the Crimson Court though. Oh my god, can we get our turns yet? It's so fast. This one by one. I think I'll buff dodge again actually. It's been working out in our favor. The blood pumps. The limbs obey. Ah uh, no, that's one off lethal. Uh baby rage. Oh, we still get blighted too. Oh, actually, no, no, that's 70%. No, never mind. That's. I shouldn't be too surprised at that one. Neat. Alright, not so bad with the spider encounter. This expedition at least promises success. Uh, Cress. I don't have room to take that actually. Because we still might have something here that can use a shovel. Because we gotta complete the rest of our room battles. And we don't know if this room or this room is. Em or actually, no, no. At least one of them is a room battle. 
So we need to keep this shovel or torches we're keeping. Medicinal herbs. I think I I can only pray for food right now. These. Yeah. Not worth taking the quest. Even if it delays me in district upgrades. Seventy, fifty, sixty-two. Really, the Hellion's the best one. Cruel machinations uh. spring to life with a singular purpose. And bandages. Take all that. Oh, I need the deeds. Is there anyone not carrying trinkets if I did it by accident? Nah, I, I can't put this on to save room. Um... How about... Uh, you know what? I'm dishing the shovels. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. God, oh god, let me find a beast carcass for the love of god. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption as the light gains purchase spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear mm. all right and before two shovel chest ah, I don't have breakthrough the one time I do want breakthrough screw you game Right now, no, 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 please. Thank you. Dodge God, Dodge God, and get down. That now we can use if it bleeds. Nice, we're good. Now we decided to focus on the ghoul here. Can we stun you? Wait, so this would have been a 50, now it's a 40% chance versus a party heal. Ah, I'm feeling lucky. Damn. <laughs> um. <laughs> that, that damage. Oh, oh, oh my god. Beautiful damage right here. Mm hmm. Dodge. No such luck. Yeah, basically 40% is essentially zero. Stirring fear consumes the mind. Do I want to keep bleeding it or 35? Mm. Yeah, sure. We're gonna be stacking bleeds. Sixteen damage bleed. Twenty damage bleed. Mm. Oh no, not the skull. Mm. Wait, we ditched our torches too, so let me try to keep stunning or something. I want to increase the torch level. Perhaps the 
turning point. Huh. I feel when we actually have too much money. Let me see. Uh, so... I can't tell if this is gonna be a... Mm, no, we probably don't need medicinal herbs. Although, there could be an enemy that has... Or I can ditch the keys, unless it's a treasure room. So, because enemies can still have a really bad debuff. Bleeds... I guess bleeds are manageable enough. Alright. Poison sap. Oh god, oh god, oh god, it's the giant, it's the giant. Forty percent. Uh, actually, you know what? Totally banked it on a 20% to remove that dodge. Oh no. Oh no. Although wait, can we do it? One to three. Wait, why is your damage so low? Oh, oh, right. Rain of Sorrows has reduced it. Right, right, right. Uh, one to three, five, ten. Still gonna take a while. Or if I move back once. Actually, yeah, I think if I move back, I can go for the kill with the Hellion. Keep dodge stacking since that's all the antiquarian can help us with. We're gonna need a a good heal here. I'm ready for that slam. I'm not ready, I'm not ready. God, you have, you have slow speed. Thank God you have slow speed. How quickly Fuck. the time turns. Transfer. with this. The ground quakes. <gasps> no! Another life wasted in the pursuit of glory and gold. Are you serious? Why is it always on the first death blow? Oh my god. Every fucking time.
Who was that? Um, I didn't give a name for that particular flagellant. Uh, and no one signed up for it. But oh my god, that sucks. Oh, come on. Oh, I actually can't heal. Oh no, I can't heal. Dodge is not gonna do me good. Died. Uh, it was a flagellant, but no one named from chat. But oh my god, this sucks. Screw it, I'm gonna make you bloodlust. No, no, that wasn't you, Patchy. That was a different flagellant. for once. God, this is gonna do nothing if it's 20, 30 damage a strike. Oh, come on! a single strike. Hey, thank you. So bloodthirsty to heal everyone. I appreciate that. Uh, that sucks though. No intrinsic merit, unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. Well, we actually get blood per week, so I can actually toss that out. sucks though, are you serious? Like, I never pass the first death blow check. Mankind hater, healer's gift. The healer's gift was healing skills during camping, so it doesn't actually mean heal skills in battle, so that's kind of whatever. This still sucks though. Yeah, one more 